Shalom and hello. This is Sister Victory. I don't celebrate birthdays anymore uh, because I found out the history of it. And so I really don't celebrate birthdays. However, uh, August 28th of 1986, my daughter Dominique was born. And I couldn't help but think of her today because of that. Because today would have been another year of her life. Um, She would have been 37 years old. But because I'm not a selfish person and I don't just think of myself often, I think of others before I do myself. And my mind began to go back and remember what our ancestors might have felt like, what my ancestors might have felt in slavery when they often lost their sons and their daughters. How much did they hurt? And at least in Dominique's situation, she had a choice. She had a choice in her life whether to be here or not. But my ancestors didn't. My ancestors didn't have a choice when they lost their daughters through sale of slavery. They didn't have a choice when they lost their sons to being beat to death. They didn't have a choice. They didn't have a choice when they lost a baby that was sold or a child that was sold. They didn't have a choice. So though my heart cries out for everyone that leaves this world too early than they had to, I still think about my ancestors who had no choice. And I try to imagine their pain, their sufferings to lose an innocent child because master chose to sell it or rape it, beat it, that child. So I give y'all the most high praise today because at least I didn't lose my child in slavery through rape hanging on a tree beat to death I say thank you father today because of Romans 8 and 28 For we know that all things work together for the good of those that love the Lord and who are called according to his purpose and plan. And I say glory, glory, hallelujah, shalom.